After five months and 22 days, today it looks like it's gonna rain, so... You see, they're getting bigger. Welcome to Asha Fritja. Today I start a new series about my experience how to convert a rice field into an area where we live and growing fruits and vegetables on a low budget. Low budget. As I'm not a professional farmer or landscaper, I would like to share with you the many mistakes I made, the cost involved, the difficulties, the benefits. Look, free. So it will help you not to make the same mistakes as I did. The main goal is to have a self-sustainable area. At the moment we have solar energy, we have our own fish, they're getting bigger. Chickens, chickens, fruits, vegetables. And my wife generates a little income by selling limes, eggs, bananas and mangoes in the season. If you take a quick second to click the thumbs up and give this video a like, what really helps my small channel. Thank you in advance. To start, I would like to share a few facts and details about Thailand. Thailand is in Southeast Asia. The land size is 513 square kilometers. That's slightly smaller than the US state of Texas. And two times of the combined size of England, Scotland and Wales. In Thailand, the currency is Thai baht. 35 Thai baht, it's around one US dollar. The year in Thailand is 2567. So they're 543 years ahead of the Western calendar year. Buddhism is the main religion in Thailand and practiced by roughly 94% of the population. The population in Thailand, it's around 171 million. I would like to explain the land measurements in Thailand. The biggest measurement is Rai. One Rai is 1,600 square meter. So 40 by 40 meters. The second one is Nan. One Nan is 400 square meters. So 20 by 20. Four Nan is one Rai. The third one, the smallest one, is Wa. One Wa is four square meter. So 400 Wa, it's one Rai. Let's have a quick walk around on my land. And what I said, it's all low budget. Come on, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. And I hope you like this series. Come on.